Welcome. In this tutorial, we are going to build a demo Nginx application on Kubernetes running on an Alibaba Cloud Container Service cluster. First, let's check our cluster is running. Head over to the Products page and click Container Service. You will arrive at the Container Service Console page. Your healthy running cluster will be visible on the Cluster List page. Click the cluster name. Copy the master node IP address. Open a terminal application and make sure you can SSH into the cluster. SSH into the cluster with root access and the password you set when you set up the cluster. Make sure Kubernetes is running with Kube Control version. Go back to the cluster list page and click Deployment. Click Create by Image. In the Basic Information tab, add details for the application name and the correct cluster it is to run on. We'll leave the defaults for namespace, replicas, and type. Click Next. In the Container tab, we can add multiple container stacks to the Kubernetes environment. Click Select Image. Select Nginx and click OK. Alibaba Cloud will provide default values for image version, but you can specify as required. If you want to ensure that Kubernetes always pulls the latest image, select Always Pull Image. Configure values for resource limit and resource request, which reflect the nature of your deployment. If you need an init container, select it here. We have left the configuration options as default, but you can configure optional environment variables. You can enable optional liveness and readiness health checks if required. You can monitor these health checks via cube control or via HTTP requests. You can configure lifecycle rules. If you need data volumes, you can configure them here also. If you want logging, configure the optional log service and make sure that Kubernetes has deployed the log plugins described in the link. When you are happy with your configurations, click Next. Now you can configure the advanced settings. We have left these default in favor of command line configuration with Kube Control. Access Control allows you to configure service and ingress details. You have the option of horizontal pod autoscaling configurations that deal with varying application loads. You can also configure optional scheduling of node and pod affinity where pods and nodes can be mapped to preferred nodes and clusters. Check all the details and, when you're ready, click Create. Success. Click View Details. You will see details of the application you just created. To set up a service, run the following command in the terminal. Now let's check the deployment details with Cube Control Get Deployments Kubernetes Project. Let's get more details on our deployment with Cube Control Describe Deployments Kubernetes Project. We can also see status information and more details about the replica sets with Cube Control Get Replica Sets. Cube Control Describe Replica Sets. Now let's create a service object that exposes the deployment. We can ask for more details on the service object with Cube Control Get Services. Back in the UI, you will see details of the service object in the Deployment Details under the Access tab. Now let's deploy another Nginx service bound to node port. We can use the bound address to curl the Nginx application and check it is running. You can now go ahead and set up more containers in the Kubernetes cluster to build out an enterprise-scale application environment. You now know how to build an Nginx application on Kubernetes running on an Alibaba Cloud Container Service cluster. Thanks for watching.